foremost, let's just have a quick update on all things Visa. Okay, so I have seven people. Everyone else either had a green card or was a joint petition already. Where are we with dancer auditions? So I talked to the choreographers. Both are confirmed and ready to do it. Update on music staff. The offers have gone out and I'm slowly getting... It goes without saying, and not to sound jaded, but New York City is the classical musical capital of the world. It's much easier from the artistic perspective of this operation to have offices in New York during the off season. We are in Santa Fe, again, a glorious place to be, but it's far off the beaten path from you know, singers coming and going to and from Europe. Yeah, put a ring on that. <laughs> I think the fan adds a lot. Alright, let's go to some more. Yeah. Oh, that's good. Yeah. Yeah. So there, yeah, I think I've drawn three greens, although I don't know if we have to have three greens. Do I just do one of these or do I do two of these? So one, two, three. I'm gonna take one of the reds away. I like this one better because it's less shiny. But yeah. that's my, that's my Well, also preference. I feel like otherwise there's not enough Chantal. We just have to 100% make sure that that's reorderable. They said it was yesterday, but, you know. Yep, yep, I think that's good. There aren't as many companies that operate just as a summer festival like Santa Fe does on the scale that Santa Fe operates. Um, we're an international company. We have international artists that come in. The effort, the budget, the time, that needs to show up on stage. We got the swatches yesterday, and I wanted to go through a couple of things. For the most part, they look great, but there are a few color issues. We did a set of swatches back in November, and then this is the second set. And the red in the most recent swatch is a bit too orange, and it reads a little bit too hot. It's a powerful business opera. I've got a very good friend uh, in this world who happens to be in the business as well. And Sometimes when whatever in the world, personal or whatever, is influencing your day-to-day -day business and feelings, you think, oh gosh, you know, why am I involved in producing opera? You know, it's just, there's no reward. But uh, the singer, who's a very, very good friend of mine, she always sort of smacks me when I say that. She goes, Brad, you are the luckiest person in the world, and I'm a part of that, and we're all here to make music, which helps us all. So... Stop fretting and get over yourself. And I think that's good advice.